gon' step up for me Make sure my fans stay cause my daughter got it everyone and thank you for coming to my channel and welcome that channel is Deb Chanel's 48 Squirrel continue to like share and subscribe to my videos and definitely share 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 subscribe 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 to me and thank you for all your continued support of my channel but let's go into this must see video y'all and again I say it's a must see video of course with my commentary and me narrating my own Topic. Okay, we get this salacious story from Celebrity Insider. Okay, and we have none other than Ashley Mitchell bringing it out to us. What a headbanger, what a headbanger, I'm telling you. These girls on Real Housewives of Atlanta, or I should say women, they keep me busy, they keep me busy. Okay, especially these two, which is Nene Leakes and Cynthia Bailey. All right, but let's go on into the title that Ashley picked as her um, chosen article she put out to social media um, on behalf of Celebrity inside of her employer. It goes, Cynthia Bailey laughs when shown that video of Nene Leak saying she's a backstabber. Okay. As fans of The Real Housewives of Atlanta may know, not too long ago, Nene Leak suggested that Cynthia Bailey is not at all a really sweet angel. Okay. Like it might appear on the show. That being said, judging by the latter's reactions to this insult, it really doesn't seem like Cynthia cares too much. While on Watch What Happened Live yesterday, Cynthia was shown the clip in which Nene was throwing shade at her and her response. She just laughed the comment off. I mean, really, what was she going to do? Cynthia ain't the best uh, shade thrower. She ain't the sharpest uh, tool in the tool shed. So she does just kind of need to sit down, look pretty, and don't say nothing. She's still on the couch. We don't want her to comment, okay, unless we need her to rebuttal something. Now, that was me. That wasn't in this article. And this article was written on November the 11th, which was Monday. I'm a little bit behind, guys, but y'all know. When I bring it, I try to bring it like a 51-year-old would, a seasoned 51-year-old would. They just keep me in the... Um, <sighs> they just keep me busy. <laughs> I can't get to no other subject because they keep me busy, boys. One or all of them are breaking news. Either they're doing good things or they just tan it up in them streets and they don't care how crazy they look. They just giving it to social media. All right. And that's a great way to stay relevant. Oh, yes, it is a great way to stay relevant, a way for us bloggers to keep uh, their names relevant in those social media streets, okay? Just don't know what to expect from day to day. You just don't know what to expect. But going back to the article, it says, it is not like it's a big secret that Nene doesn't like Cynthia. She is well aware, but that is not to say she will let it get to her, okay? So while she was a guest on Watch What Happens Live, she was shown the never-be-seen clips of Nene calling her a backstabber and more. Cynthia has done seven interviews. Cynthia wants people to think that she's this really nice, sweet angel. And then next time you turn around, you take a gun out and shoot a itch when she ain't even looking. Nene tells the camera in the footage. Okay, seeing this, Cynthia could not help but laugh and say between chuckles, Oh, God, that made you laugh. Mm. Don't put God in the center. You know, you know she's telling some truth because you got Mike Hill in the back telling you, feeding you what to say, girl. Because you ain't been like this before until Mike Hill came into your life. You ain't been up top uh, searching for a storyline. You always been that passive type chick that wanted to hang on whoever is gunning for and looking very impressive that season that you need to uh be the sidekick for come on Cynthia, you know better you know better girl but we want you to stay on that couch looking pretty don't say that don't say nothing okay uh going back to the article said you haven't seen that yet the host tried to make sure and the reality tv star confirmed that she indeed hadn't okay she then went on to say look you guys just have to watch the season all I can say is that, you know, I still, despite everything that I've been through with Nene, I still have love for her. And I hope that we can get to at least a respectful place. <laughs> and that was the end of the commentary. 
that Mrs. or I should say Miss Ashley Mitchell wrote on behalf of her employer, Celebrity Insider. Okay, good commentary, good commentary. But sit there out to know, girl, stop playing, stop playing. You got your man, your man is doing real well in the sports arena. He's trying to take your hand, and y'all solidify a talk show host deal. Hopefully, it goes real well. Hopefully, you get a prenup, and hopefully, you get some money. And Mike ain't just playing you like an opportunity. Uh, opportunist plays a, a violin and a fiddle. Okay, girl. Hopefully, we won't hear no long, drawn-out uh, crime scene later on down the road that you didn't think he was like this and he, and, you know, he done dumped you or he done got caught doing something he ain't got no business uh, doing and you just can't seem like you can uh, marry him at this time. Okay, girl. I don't think I'm saying. Pump your brakes, Cynthia. Sit and think long and hard before you say I do once again, okay? Because you're going to be out, out, out. All right? Out like clout, child. But anyway, that is all I had for Cynthia Bailey uh, story on this particular video. I'm sure she's going to come out with some more stuff. We're going to be having our eyebrows raised, too, and our fingers pointing to our temple like, what the heck? How is she doing out there now? What is she doing, Lord? What is she doing? Because to, the, to me these days, Noelle is looking like the parent and Cynthia is looking like the child. I will kid you not. That girl, Noelle, knows where she's coming from. It's like she done been here before. You know what I'm saying? Coming back in another form. That spirit has been here before. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Because she got too much class about herself. And even though she was taking some thought pictures over there that I did see on her Instagram account, but you know, baby girl's young, she got to feel herself, she got to feel her environment, and she got to make her own decisions. But I'm telling you, Noelle is uh, thinking and seeing to be a little bit more responsible and level-headed. And she could play in, you know, different fields just to, I guess, test the waters to see what she likes, what she don't like. But she seems to be a well-thought-out, well-rounded individual. And I'm like, hmm, where did she get that from? Golly, where did she get that from? Because I, I tell you, some of it Miss Cynthia. It missed it. It ain't because the mama probably, meaning her mother didn't teach her well or, or teach her about life lessons and how uh, life would teach you will be a great experience teacher for you. I don't know. Cynthia just uh, got off the boat somewhere and just wanted to go into some deserted island and, and, and do her own thing. And, and, and it's just been representing like a child state of mine, okay? But anyway, that's all I have for this video. Y'all get down and tell me what y'all thought about the subject matter in this video. And see if we can compromise and we have to agree to disagree. All right, but thank you for all uh, supporting my channel again. And I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.